joining us, and we begin tonight with breaking developments about some very frightening moments on the mat at today's state wrestling tournament. A senior from Creston Orient, Maxburg, rushed to the hospital after he suffered a seizure. Sports director Andy Garman is joining us now. Yeah, certainly. Scary moments. Take your breath away kind of time there at Wells Fargo Arena. Taylor Pettit, a 170-pound senior, was wrestling up at 182 in the state team duels. KCCI's Ryan Smith spoke with people who were there when the incident happened. He's live in the newsroom now with the very latest. Ryan? Yeah, Andy, that's right. Officials say Pettit is in stable but critical condition right now. The doctor who was there on scene when it happened told me a quick response by paramedics saved the teen's life. Eyewitnesses tell KCCI Taylor Pettit went down moments after his match on Mat 5. Here's a picture of the Creston Orient Maxburg student just before he suffered a seizure. It's one of those feelings that you never want to have to go through. Um, thankful that the emergency staff was here. Our trainer, Chris Leonard, was here. That trainer spotted Pettit struggling to breathe. The on call doctor, Dennis Zachary, rushed to the mat for a diagnosis. Then he seized, and then after he seized, he wasn't breathing. And then that's when I said, You, need, you got an AED? And they go, uh, Yes, and then they grabbed it and put it on. Zachary says medical personnel shocked the teen twice before he left the mat. Protocol was followed to perfection. Everybody was calm, everybody knew what to do, everybody did their did next step, next step, next step. Pettit remains in stable but critical condition at Mercy Medical Center. He's a fighter. The whole families are a bunch of fighters, great people. The Creston crowd tonight is thankful for the medical staff's response. The doctor on scene gives all his praise to the paramedics. Paramedics did a great job and they need to be thanked. They saved his life. And as we learned tonight, a medical doctor is present at all times throughout the duration of the state tournament, and an ISU athletic trainer is watching at every mat. Andy? All right, Ryan Smith live in the newsroom. Thank you very much. Later on in sports, Tony Seaman will join me with the winners from tonight's state team duels championship.